Hey, Libra. Back again. I got more messages. More messages. Why am I hearing Christmas songs? <laughs> what the crap? Why is the King of Swords coming out in every tarot reading, in every tarot deck, Libra? I feel that this is a person outside of you. Even if you're a masculine Libra. I don't feel like this is your energy. This is someone outside of you. This person is in the Nine of Swords. King of Swords, Nine of Swords. About you. Because something's over. The death card. I just heard maybe next lifetime. And that breaks this King of Swords heart even more. Even though he seems to be a pretty cold king of swords, he does have a heart. Wow. Wow. I have chills. Three of swords. This shows someone grieving. This king of swords either recently lost out on you, Libra. And they know they're, it, it's, in, it's done. It's done. Or they recently lost someone in their life. Or they're reenacting this traumatic loss. They could be going to visit this person's grave. This Three of Swords card shows an elephant, um, an elephant at a fellow elephant's grave because elephants do mourn. Highly intelligent, emotional animals. This person feels silly. This King of Swords energy. We have the blue-footed booby at the bottom. That's literally what this bird is called. See his blue feet, his blue bill. It's called the blue-footed booby, and this is the Knight of Cups. So either their offer was rejected or they messed this up somehow. Between you two. Knight of Wands. The Ostrich. They put their head in the sand. Way too much. Denying the issues. Denying the problems. Maybe denying the They had a problem or issues that they just did not want to, could not, were not able at that point in time to heal, to work through. Maybe this King of Swords has gone through so much loss or dark nights of the soul. That that's literally all they know how to do is put their head in the sand. This person misses an elder figure in their life. We have the tortoise. 
a very, very old tortoise in this Nine of Pentacles energy. This elder figure that they miss tremendously could have been very independent. Nine of Pentacles, a very self-sufficient person, a leader. Ten of Pentacles. Whoa, with the Ten of Cups at the bottom. I'm not trying to say that you should be with this person or if you've already been with them, give them another chance. No. But we have 1010 at the bottom. Look at these families. It's a family in both of these cards. This King of Swords loves their family or wants a family with you, Libra. Like this, this is their, their dream come true. The Ten of Pentacles, I'm sorry if I said swords. The Ten of Pentacles and the Ten of Cups, 10-10. Ten, ten. I heard insatiable because these look like jackrabbits to me and rabbits produce at such a fast pace maybe this king of swords was is uh insatiable wow i haven't had that word channel to me I'm not even going to say <laughs> it's been some years. It's been a few years, but it was a situation and my guide was like, they're insatiable. I was like, oh, there's nothing you, there's, it's not you. <laughs> there's nothing wrong with you, Libra. Wow, the emperor is here. And I'm hearing the song. Got the whole world in his hands. He's got the whole world in his hands. Wow, the emperor with the wheel of fortune. Now I need to know yes or no. Are these the same people or are these two different masculine energies? Let's get the pendulum. Okay, spirit. Thank you. Is this king of swords and emperor the same person? Yes or no? Yes or no? Is the King of Swords and the Emperor the same masculine?
Yes. Yes, they are. Gosh. They really feel like you're their destiny, Libra. Destiny. What's Libra's advice? Libra's advice. The magician. It seems like you two have had many lives together, Libra. Whether you've been together in this one yet or not, you've had many lives together. Look at the infinity symbol over the fox. You are the magician. You hold the power here, Libra. I'm hearing it's your world. They're just an emperor in it. But it's your world. You hold the power. Your advice is the magician with the wheel of fortune. And I heard you decide your destiny, Libra. Ooh-wee. I had to get back on here because I felt guided. And maybe we can get some different tarot cards out the next reading. And this King of Swords can feel sufficient uh, with this message and all the airtime they have been receiving as of late in my readings. Are you satisfied yet? Oh, that's right. Insatiable. Oh boy, Libra. Well, just know that you you're the director of your destiny in this life. You have all the tools of the trade at your disposal as the magician and you hold the power here. I'm going to end this reading. If you found some messages, I appreciate your support. Give me a big thumbs up. Until next time, always stay balanced, stay blessed. Peace, Libra.